Hi everyone, welcome back to another gameplay of Genshin Impact. So, um, the there is just uh, eight days left to uh, to get everything that is left out of this beautiful event, Lantern uh, Right. And uh, just remember, guys, to try to complete to get all the quests, so you can get uh, Mora, you can get Primogens. Uh, complete also the quests here on the Theater Mechanicus, so you can get all the talismans and therefore you can go into the market and you can get everything so uh everything can be purchased uh if uh, if you got all the quests done and and as well remember the 1000 talismans for the free hero to choose uh i i chose a ningguang in my personal uh, case because i really wanted her in my team she works very nicely with Keqing, uh because of the uh, shards the the, the shields uh, and so, uh, yeah, I really wanted to, to try her out, uh, and yeah, so these four now are gonna be my main team. I know there is, are four different elements, so that means that uh, on the elemental resonance, I just gain, um, like, defense, I think. Uh, yeah, it's just 15% more elemental and physical resistance, but yeah, even if it's just la that, I just like the interaction between these four characters, you know, uh, a Bennett as a support and then extra attack then chi chi for the heals um and then in one for the for the shields uh also for the elemental reactions catching main dps so uh so yeah that's uh, my team as you guys know i'm a free to play player and therefore um i cannot really like i don't have a ton of mora i don't have a ton of stuff that i can unlock and therefore what happens is that I have to use my Mora and all the, all the experience books and all the stuff very wisely. Because uh, otherwise I'm going to just uh, run out and I will not be able to, uh, to level up further. So in this case I got Ningguang yesterday and I gathered Ascension 4 right away. Uh, I had uh, saved a lot of Mora and a lot of uh, experience for her. But as you can see I cannot get past uh, here because I just don't have enough. Um, but uh, but yeah, that was uh, that. This was the character I got. But depending, you know, on your own team, you may have chosen like, for example, Xinq also was available. Um, maybe you wanted some constellations. Uh, also, Chungyun was available. Then I think uh, Beidou also was available, and uh, uh, Xianling, and also Xinyan. That I don't even have her, but uh, she was also one of the characters that you could choose from this. Uh, um, from this event and yeah depending on your team really the best choice is always uh, go for a character that you know you are gonna use in your team so don't go for a character just because you want to try it out or because you don't have it or whatever uh, but go for a character that you know you're gonna use that is gonna be useful for you so uh, yeah that's why I chose uh, Ningguang and um, and then uh, in terms of wishes I just want to show you guys this because it's very very funny uh, I was saving up a lot for this banner right here not uh, because of Keqing but because of the fact that there is a Bennett and Ningguang in the roster so that means that the probability of uh, uh, having a Bennett and Ningguang uh, or in this case also Barbara is uh, uh, higher and uh, I always do wishes 10 out of like uh, 10 each time so that means that it's guaranteed the probability of having uh, a four star character uh, because it says uh, here where it is guaranteed to win a four star or both item at least in 10 attempts so um, so yeah I really wanted to reach possibly C6 Bennett and maybe you know C2, C3, Ningguang that would have been awesome but uh, uh, look at my luck I did five wishes between like two or three days ago uh, and look at this I got uh, uh, a Barbara, then I got only weapons, then I got another Barbara, and another one, and uh, I got uh, one Bennett, yeah, here we go, and I got one Bennett, and that was it, so the 17th of uh, February was the first day I started doing the uh, the wishes on this banner. So as you can see guys, I got extremely unlucky because this is like extreme uh, 
unluckiness. I don't know how to collect otherwise. And uh, yeah, just got one Bennett, zero Ningguangs, and three Barbaras. So I don't, I don't really think it can get worse than that. Um, and uh, now I still need to do 20 more wishes to have the guarantee probability of having a five-star character. So um, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's 20 more wishes that I need to do. Uh, because every 90 attempts is uh, there is the five star guarantee, but again, it's not guaranteed it's gonna be Keqing. It might be any other five star item. So it could be a weapon, or it could be like Mona, uh, Diluc, uh, you know, Jean, uh, and uh, Chichi. So any other free uh, five star character. So yeah, uh, I really wanted, as I said before, C6 Bennett because I had already him C3, but I only got him C4. I got zero Ningguang, so she's still C0. And I got three Barbaras. So now I have this uh, character right here that I don't really use, C5. Like, I, I don't know how more unlucky you can get, but, uh, and yeah, Bennett is still stuck here. Um, and uh, Ningguang, as I said before, C0. So yeah, extremely, extremely unlucky. But yeah, when you're a free-to-play player, um, you know, there is, and probability is bad, there is nothing you can do because uh, you can't uh, uh, change, you can't trade your characters for other ones, you can't change in any way the outcome. So uh, if you are unlucky in uh, many, many wishes in a row, uh, yeah, it's just uh, there is nothing you can do. So hopefully in the next 11 days, I will be able to uh, collect enough primogens to uh, to do some more, more wishes here in this banner, hopefully I can get one more Bennett or one more Ningguang, uh, and uh, yeah, that would be awesome. But but yeah, let's see what the game uh, has uh, in store for me. And, and yeah, that's uh, that was pretty much what I wanted to do. Um, and uh, and yeah, here are the theater mechanicus. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen already some videos on YouTube. Uh, the best strategy is always going for a uh, water and then uh, the frozen tower. So in that way you have the freeze effect and freeze effect is very powerful because it's gonna stop completely the enemies from moving. Uh, and also the water tower deals uh, some pretty good damage. Uh, and then after you get these two towers, you can get like an extra pyro tower, especially if you get some buffs in uh, uh, at the end of each round uh, or electro. Like these two are normally the ones you're gonna build after you get water and, uh, and creo. And, uh, and yeah, so these four towers are pretty much your core. Remember as well always to buff your towers. So get uh, a, an Arcanum. Uh, and then sometimes in certain scenarios, having a mine right before the, the exit could be an idea. Mines do a huge amount of damage. And so uh, yeah, the recovery mechanicals are not really that important because you're gonna end up getting a ton of uh, Venericus points, whatever. Uh, so at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter if you get this. So yeah, just go for the buffs, then freeze, and then pyro and electro. Sometimes for certain enemies, especially geo ones, you may want to replace like electro with uh, uh, this tower right here that deals increased damage against uh, 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 geo enemies. So uh, yeah, sometimes if uh, depending on the waves, uh, you, you could uh, you could go with that. I haven't even unlocked this last thing. And uh, but just by you know reading up here, it seems that it's pretty useless because uh, like the fact that you can teleport to another portal, it's I don't really see the point. So uh, so yeah, that's uh, that's it for the theater mechanicus. And also the 3.0, you can play in a co-op mode. Uh, it becomes a little easier because you can build more towers from the first wave. So um, so yeah, you. I just recommend playing on co-op until difficulty seven. You can play it alone, but then in the very last mode, uh, I just recommend playing on co-op with uh, some friends. And uh, and yeah, that was the video I really wanted to to do. So you could see my my luck and uh, all these all these last things in this uh, event. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed and see ya. Bye bye.